Hello watch fans, Berth here watches here and this time for you we have a very distinctive Seiko chronograph. It's not as old as most of our stock but when you see something like this that is so different you think well I've got to buy it. You've got this very strange almost snake head shape in a dark material which is plated. You can see there's a little bit of scuff here and that ridge, and it is a ridge, goes all the way around the bracelet. Again you can see a little bit of wear right on the top of that ridge. Gives it a very dramatic look. That with a little pop of red on the chronograph and alarm hands. Some people are going to love it, some are going to hate it. It's got hour markers etched into the outside but only on the top half. The case is actually cranked over, so this side is thicker than this side, so it sits on your wrist facing you. These teardrop chronograph pushers and the crown are also treated in this uh, coated material. I think it's uh, Eon plated, but I'm not sure. Ion Eon. Bracelet's a good size, it's been cleaned in our ultrasonic bath, it's the solid link bracelet, unlike the earlier Seikos, but it's still worth cleaning, of course. And because this is such a, oh, I'm going to say weird, because it is weird, I'm going to show it on the wrist. You can really see there how it's cranked over a little bit. Not an enormous amount, we've got earlier Seikos which were cranked over a lot more. So although it's different and unusual, it's not bad. Let's see if I can stretch this out a little bit. Sits on the wrist quite nicely. And I'm not a fan of bigger watches. So let's take that off again. A couple more little spots of damage to report. Uh, there is a scratch on the Hardlex crystal just there, you see. There's probably one or two others. They, these do scratch these crystals, but that's one of the better ones. You can see there's also a scuff on there. And because it is a larger watch, you've got one or two little smaller bumps on the case. But overall, presents well. And it comes down to the question of having never seen one before do you like it if you do there's more details on berthierwatches.com everything's working including the alarm and the chronograph obviously and uh, the instructions for which are also on that same site then there is a link in the comments below thanks for watching